We've arrived um, at our second port, Santa Margarita, Italy. And the gorgeous sun is shining through clouds. So we are gonna go into Santa Margarita where they're known for their pesto and the gelato. And we're gonna have both. And then we're gonna walk the other direction to Portofino. It's a four mile trail along the coast. And here it's beautiful. If it's anything like this, I know it's beautiful. I'm standing on my balcony this morning just enjoying uh, breakfast and the beautiful view of Italy. We're off the ship. We got off in Santa Margarita by Tinder. Actually, there you can see the little Tinder right there. And we have walked as we're heading to Portofino, we'll zoom out all the way along this coastline here on this pathway. It's a beautiful walk. You need good shoes. It's not just cobblestones and stuff. But it is very pretty. And we're taking a little break in the shade because I'm out of shape. We got off the, uh, the road path about halfway, and now we're on this little path that overlooks the area. You can hear the bugs. I don't know what kind of bugs those are, but this is the path that will take us the rest of the way, and we don't have to walk on the road because the, the road sidewalk kind of ended. It feels good up here. The shade and the breeze. I'm hot. Uh, but I'm having fun and I'm making memories. We're here in Portofino. We finally made it. And this is a sculpture museum that they have with some pretty interesting sculptures. And the port. And up there on the hill is Brown Castle that you can walk to and tour. Actually, I see the cruise ship way over there. It was a long walk, a hot walk. But we made it! And this is Portofino. Water is crystal clear. I see some fish. It is a beautiful place. But however, we did just sit down and have a soda, and it was ten dollars per person. My son had water, and my daughter had Coke, and I had Coke, and my husband had a beer, and it was. $40, so <laughs> Portofino can be a little expensive to sit down and have a drink. One last look of Portofino before we head off on the ferry. It's just filled with restaurants, 
shops, and tourists. <laughs> it's pretty much it's pretty much Portofino. I mean that is literally it right there, except for a few little back roads. Lots of cafes with outdoor seating areas. It's a beautiful place. We decided to take a ferry back from Portofino. My husband actually walked, but he's a runner and in much better shape than me, so I decided to take a ferry. Santa Margarita, Italy, right off of the ship. And it's just right here in the middle of town. <laughs> right over there, we ate uh, several cafes and restaurants. They're known for their pesto here. It's supposed to be different than other places, but it was delicious. Absolutely delicious. I did not taste the difference between really good pesto and the stings. <laughs> but I did enjoy it. Anyway, you can just step right off the tender and just enjoy all kinds of things. The beach, restaurants, shopping. Very easy port. One last look at the Italian Riviera. We're back on the balcony of our ship's room. And uh, there's Santa Margarita. And we walked and walked and walked and walked. Where you can't even see. And around that corner to Portofino. <laughs> and then we had um, pesto pasta and pesto pizza in Santa Margarita and gelato, chocolate gelato is delicious. It was a good day. Tomorrow, Alguero, Sardinia. Never been there. Looking forward to new adventure.